bitch on the ones. Percocet keeping me calm. Got my hand on my gun. Focused on making it. What's up, nigga, motherfucking Uncle Spliff, man? Spliff DTV, man. We what out here in Atlanta man. fucking with Lou Soldier. What's up, baby? What you do, man? What the fuck you do, man? What the fuck you do? Man, how I feel, man? Shit, man. We saw you motherfucking come up before our motherfucking eyes, man. At the gate, man. KGB shit. You know what I'm saying? All right, so shit, man. Where you from? Uh, out of Birmingham, right? Yeah, yeah. All right. Fast, yeah. All right, so shit, man. You know, Alabama really, really... Ain't had too many artists come out that bitch, man. I remember motherfucking Dirty, yeah. uh, motherfucking the real Mr. Big, and um, uh, and lately the biggest artist to come out of uh, Birmingham has been Dobie. Yeah, no, Not, no, no, that, that's out of Montgomery. That's Montgomery. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Alabama though. All right, so let me ask you this: like with with the the come up with Dobie, man, like how was his passing affected the like the the rap community out there? Oh, that shit. Was or just the streets, shit. period. That shit was devastating, on mom. Was Dobie was was Dobie a big uh, influence to you? Yeah, yeah, big influence, on mom. Man, nigga, preacher, for real. Okay, okay. All right, now let me ask you this, man. How did you? Uh, how did the connection with you and your uh, uh, you and Fabo come come about? Uh, I did it. Man, I had. Uh, I think he hit me up one day when I had first started rapping, and you feel me. We we kind of just like we just went from there, you know what I'm saying? Okay, okay. All right, so uh, I noticed well your big your biggest song right now was the you, was the feature with J D Younger. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Now after that song dropped, bro, how was the glow up, man? This shit was goddamn. Shit was crazy. And then you back down with. Cause put a lot of you feel me, got a lot of eyes. You know what I'm saying? They like they let nigga hard. And then other shit dropping. They like this shit just getting harder and harder. So it's like up from there. You feel me? Yeah. And then you back down with that motherfucking that uh caught that freestyle that caught my spirits, man. Like that shit was stupid, bro. When it was stupid. <laughs> stupid, man. God <laughs> damn. Hey, I'm keep it. I'm gonna be real with you, man. That, that nigga, you you did your thing on that hoe. Kick and flavor, man. Nah, this nigga said kick and flavor, <laughs> man. <laughs> hey, man. So, hey, so uh, let's, let's let's talk about Lou Soldier and your childhood, man. How was how was Lou Soldier for us uh, growing up in Birmingham, man? Uh, I grew up on the east side. You feel me? My all my family, they from you know what I'm saying. I'm out of town, dig. I'm a swine out of town, dig. But you feel me? I was born. You feel me? I moved to Birmingham. I started school in Birmingham. You feel me? And I stay on the east side. All through the east side, robust seven point, all through that shit, tearing all that. So you feel me? And growing up, goddamn, I just you feel me? I ain't you feel me. So it's the east side, the east side of Birmingham. That's like the trenches. I mean, you feel me? You can say that. You know what I'm saying? We just, you know what I'm saying? It's just Birmingham period. It's just, it's small. You know what I mean? It's just, it's hard to explain Birmingham to you feel me? Other people, cause it's just, it's just really crazy to me. <laughs> Hey, now, now I heard in one of your lyrics, man, you used to call you called it murder ham. At the gate. Yeah, all right. So, so smart, and, 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 and nigga, think we country till they see the murder rate. Hell yeah, nah, saying? nigga, that motherfucker ain't that. That motherfucker be on first <laughs> forty out of goddamn time, <laughs> nigga. I said, shit, nigga, murder ham popping, man, for real. She really wicked at that though, for real, bro. No oh, mom. So, um, so let me ask you this, bro. So, do do you think that like when when you started rapping? Rapping was your escape from the streets. For real. If, 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 Cause if. A lot of my partners, you know what I'm saying, that I was, cause you feel me, I'm blessed to, you feel me, I graduated, you feel me, and shit like that, but you feel me, when I got out, you feel me, it was just, you feel me, losing people, and then you feel me, partners, you feel me, going down the road, I'm catching cases and shit, so you know what I'm saying. And I knew, I, you feel me, I always knew I could, you know what I'm saying, put words together, so you know what I'm saying, when I took that rapping shit serious, it wasn't, it, you feel me, escape from that shit. So you, a lot of your partners that's that's, that's that's back in Birmingham, you, you got a lot of partners that's locked up or passed away? Passed away, yeah, dad, yeah, you know I mean, locked up. That's crazy. Sense. Niggas, you so young though, bro. <laughs> shit, you're crazy, bro. The first shit, for people that, don't, that people don't know, how, how old are you? I'm 19. 19? 19. Uh, so, you 19 years old, how the fuck you get the name Loose Soldier? <laughs> shit. Man, show them boys that chain real quick, man. Go ahead and pop it up, man. Yeah, I know what the fuck it is. Yeah. Like, 
But how the fuck you get the name Lou Souza, man? Man, goddamn. Um, <laughs> my grandma and my mama, they used to call me, like, you feel me, so slim. And then you feel me, when I started rapping, they always wanted me to start that now, like, here now, because out of respect for so slim, so you know what I'm saying? I just threw something together with so slim, and it just came from there. Well, you know something that makes sense though. So, 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 did your grandma call you so the slim just off, just off your, your, your off appearance? Off my appearance, yeah. Hold up, but nigga, your your rapping style though kind of similar to that though. Yeah, I mean, you feel me? I, I mean, I, you feel me? I listen to so slim. I like all this shit. You know what I'm saying? So, you feel me? Yeah. I'm an old head type of nigga. Like I listen. Like, I can tell. Like, then, you know what I'm saying? I don't listen to the new generation rap for real. Yeah, you gotta. I can tell. It, I can tell, nigga, cause when like your lyrics, nigga, like you use. It's a lot of like the new generation rappers. I really can't get really vibe with. You know what I'm talking about? But, yeah. but I, like your shit, I can ride out to your shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So hey, hey, so you got you got the day the debut is a is an album or is a mixtape? Oh, it's a. Uh, shit, it was, I think it's an album. I think it's an album. It's an album. Okay. So, uh, uh, so let's, let's let's talk about one of the lead singles on that bitch, Contraband. Oh, that motherfucker. You know what oh, I'm saying? That's how, Contraband itself, man. That <laughs> motherfucker illegal. Right, so, 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 how, how did you, how did you come up with the concept of that song? Man, shit, it's just What the fuck was going on? <laughs> oh my, just you feel me? That's all I can say. No man. So it's just, hey, hey, the streets know? Yeah, the gate. Okay, okay, okay. Man, to the O. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, so with this uh, J.D. Young and uh, um, collab, bro, how the fuck that came about? Oh, uh, shit, through cinematic, you feel me? They feel me? We linked up like that, through shite like that. Just smashed the young one, got them a uh, uh, crazy ass song. Okay. So, nigga, you really was thugging since you was 12? Yeah, the gate. Nah, nigga, nah, straight up. <laughs> At the gate. At the gate. Okay, okay. I'm still not stores all that bullshit, but I've been doing this shit. So, so when niggas check your motherfucking, when the niggas check your background, it's gonna check out. At the gate. At the gate. Okay, okay. You gotta be homeless. Feel my all that shit. Alright, so, uh, what loose soldier? What what artist loose soldier listening to right now? Besides yourself. I really shit. I'm really on the Alabama movement type shit right now. You feel me? I'm really listening to all the Alabama artists for this. So what Alabama artists like the world can check out, man? Cause I ain't gonna even lie, the Birmingham movement is it's moving right now. Yeah. It's heavy. It's real crazy. Little Bam, yeah, Honey Tech, Free Free Tech. You know what I'm saying? Then the Force Automobile. You feel me? Uh, no Cap, Rilo, Peas. It's a lot of folks out of Alabama, man. Da. I'm really on all this shit right now. That's all I really. That's all I really listen to. Yeah, yeah. Cool myself. All right, so let me ask, ask you this: with with your newfound fame, bro, and you know, and your motherfucking clout going up, do you feel any hate coming from the from like from the, from your old from your old peoples, like your old friends? No, not really. No, you no. Know, really love for real, for real. Okay. So it's just, you feel me, the folks that been hanged, that's the folks that, you feel me, hate. I don't yeah. get no fuck about that. <laughs> yeah. So niggas that been hating before, before the glow up, they still hate. Yeah, they, you feel me, they hate a little bit harder. You know, so. <laughs> oh, look, man. Back to back, back to back. All right, so 2019, what can what can we expect from you? Pressure. What kind oh, of? A whole lot of motherfucking pressure. Shit, we got, we got any new, new mixtapes, any new singles? I got shit with Peas, I got shit with Long Way, I got... Hold on, hold on, hold on, back that up. You got shit with who? With Peas? Long Peace? Way, yeah, Peas. Ain't Long Way? Okay, okay, okay. Shout out to Wee Wee. Okay. Is there, any, is there any features that you want? Like, is there any artists out there you want to work with? I mean, you feel me? I, I really like, you know what I'm saying, like... If we, you feel me, get in, you know what I'm saying? I don't really like just reaching out, though, to be honest. So we get in, we get in, you know what I'm saying? But I just, like, reaching out, I ain't gonna keep tingling.